Hello everyone, Mappy here with, well, a little bit more weird and unfortunate things are happening. So, previously I did a little bit of grinding for, for Obels to buy the, to get into the ticket mines to get the key to the final dungeon so we can go buy that now. Um, which actually only took one fight. The reason why it's taken me so long to make up a new video is just because, you know, I... Yeah, Funk. Let's just call it the Funk. Not even the Fun Funk. Um, so yeah, let's buy this. The Hell Key. Ha 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 ha! You actually bought the key! Magnificent! But will you actually use it? You're an amusing human indeed. Yeah, we'll go use it. But first, before we do that, we have some people to- we have something- we have an area I would like to go check. Be back in a second. Okay, we're in like the little shortcut- yeah, the shortcut area in Raphael. I, it's been so long that I've forgotten how to speak, oh no. Mostly because there are some NPCs here that we couldn't understand prior. I will tell you your magic number. 89. What does it mean? Uh, I actually can tell you. Yes, I think. The higher the number, the more secrets you have found. Yep, that's exactly what it means. So it's basically just a, you found 89% of the secrets, which means we're going to find 11% of the secrets. Oops. Keep talking to people um down in makio which is quite a lot of secrets if you think about it honestly given that i've kind of scoured the rest of the map <laughs> honestly does the matriarch know how selfish the inner ones really are her own children spoiled by her kindness i want her back too but not like this rathiel is a land with many doors why are there so many doors in here Good questions. Those who seek absolute truth, some of them go astray. Their spirit can enter that hell. There, illusions are strongest. Even gods stay away. The hell key. Do you want it? Urok is not allowed to sell it. Not until the threat of the inner evocations has been addressed. There's going to be someone... There's going to be a comment here. But, uh... You know, I'm going to run to the place where we can use our key. But between that, I actually have something I would like to talk about. So here's that little like cute splash screen that we saw near the ending. And I just wanted to point out a couple things that stood out to me. First of all, if we uh, scroll all the way over, zoom in a little bit, that's a little keychain of amethyst. That's heartbreaking, honestly. Uh. Because remember, Dottie doesn't know that she died. I presume that none of these, none of these adults have told her. Um, the other thing that I just thought was I, I wanted to talk about was the fact that, honestly, my mouse is on the fritz. I have to swap it over to my laptop's trackpad but yeah nothing is wrong and i thought this was a callback to the like intro message on the itch.io store page but i checked and no this is really just a message that's nothing is wrong we solved the problem everything is fine so yeah that's just i, I just wanted to focus on those like two little things I'm presuming that these are the horoscopes that have been marked fate. Everyone's in, like, cool alternate outfits. Like, Dottie's looks pretty similar, but Lamar's in a Hawaiian shirt. Absolutely splendid. Anyway, back to the game. And to hell. Alright, so this is the entranceway. Well, this is the entrance to Macchio. You don't want to go here. It's not a good place. Makyo, the encounter bar is always red there. Sounds bad. Oh, that sounds a little bit miserable. Beyond the store, things are terrible. There is seriously nothing good in there. It is disappointing. Only go there for the challenge if you really want to. Just don't expect anything good. 
I mean, if you keep telling me that I'm not going to find anything good, clearly I have to find something good in there. This gross keyhole, the hell key, you get an ominous feeling. Try using it here anyway? No. 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 Yes, actually. All right. And I kind of like how it just kind of deletes the entire wall. Wonderful. Let's see if these guys say anything different now. Nope, you just keep telling me that the encounter bar is red. Yep. Okay, so we're actually going to save once... Now that I've done the inevitable. There's no one going back now. Miss Copeland, surely even your dulled human senses can discern the considerable danger ahead of you. You stand on the threshold of Macchio, forbidden to even the evocations. She just kind of looks... There is nothing within that fell space which could possibly be of benefit to our plans. No humans to rescue, no allies to gain, no other thing but death and suffering await you. You have no reason to violate its sacred boundaries. I know that you are a singularly willful personage, but I must demand that you turn away this instant. So, you're not happy with all this? Smell death ahead. Death and pain. Too much. Mm hmm. Humans, this way bad things. Very bad. Stop. Nope. We continue. Is there anything to the side? No. Whoa, 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 hang on, guys. This place is way too scary for you little fellas. I was like, eh. No, come on. Why don't we all turn around and go back the way we came, okay? There's nothing here for you. C guys? Hmm. Bold of you to challenge, make you. I didn't realize you were so confident in your powers. And Donnie's like, I don't understand any of this. I cannot see why you would want to go to this place now. Still, if you must. Although, I can't say I do not feel a thrill at the thought of trying our might against those within. Even so. So yeah, this is going to be a combat dungeon. And I'm going to probably do something a little bit different. I'm just... I'm probably just going to leave in the fights. as we go through, because there's going to be a lot of them. And editing out all of them sounds not like my idea of fun. So we are going to just explore everything. Okay, so there's two ways down. Let's take the left path first. And hey, this will let you guys see some of the enemies that I've been skipping out on. Um, You know, I, have, I do have to fight things because yeah I gotta fight things it's now I need to remember what everyone's cool things are um do 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 let's just drain everyone's stuff right everything's gonna be super tanky in here because it's the final Final dungeon. Maybe I should just edit out these fights. <laughs> it's gonna be great grinding, though. Honestly. Not that I'm gonna need it, primarily, because, oh my god. Um. Got a cataclysm. <sighs> this is a good question. Which. Who should I heal? more. Let's health surge Dottie, and Dottie can... Do I have anything good for hitting everyone? It's been, it's been a little while. Reign of Anger. Fool. But yeah, no, I wasn't gonna just like open these up to chat about the fight or anything. Um, my main thought is like, and Honestly, part of the reason why I've been in a bit of funk is because after Macchio, like, there's no more of this. I'm... <laughs> I have to figure out what I'm going to play next, and it's been a little while, and I'm not sure what I want to play next. Oh, right, I need to blind anger everyone. Um... And I have not even been paying attention enough attention to what everyone's weak to. I know shameful display. Let's feed this 
do that to you, and let's just continue to reign of anger. I know, combat is super exciting. Because, like, I've been thinking, um, one idea I've had is there's another, like, RPG maker JRPG that I'm kind of interested in playing, but ugh, Grave Poison, really? Let's kill you, let's kill you. Actually, let's, let's heal. Yeah, guess you. Let's... Cataclysm again. Crawling Chaos. The Tindalos, honestly, because it's most, has most health. But yeah, no, there's another RPG I've been thinking of doing, which would be rather short, but again, I'm like 21 hours into this one. And I've got a few more hours from, you know, just this dungeon, apparently. So I'm not sure if I'm, if I'm still going to be in a JRPG mood. Or if you guys are going to be in, like, a watching JRPG mood. Uh, let's... I don't need to really do anything that insane. I just need to... Hit things, really. But, uh... Yeah, because I'm also, like... After this one, um... Thanks to... <laughs> thanks to just going ham with the wacky voices I'm I'm, I'm thinking I want to play either something with that actually has voice acting in it so I don't have to oh what do you want if you want to pass find something for me an infernal icon I want it grant my wish and you'll be able to continue cool all right, and over here we have Ancient Mind Pill. Cool. But yeah, so I'm... And unfortunately, like... My... Like, I don't know. I legitimately don't know what I'm going to play next. Let's Overdrive, honestly. I don't know why I've not been doing that. Um, and I should probably pay a little bit more attention to what everyone's doing. Doop. Okay, so anger appears to be the wrong thing to use against these guys. Or is it that... No, I think her reign of anger is... Oh wait, no, anger is the right thing to use against these guys. Oh no, it was... It's, um... Terror damage isn't bad against these guys. Okay. But they're mach and they're machines, so spat barrage, cataclysm, which should hit pretty hard. Cataclysm, which should hit pretty hard. Um, I wasn't paying attention to what kind of damage they dealt. Crap. Uh, let's mind over matter, the walker, and hit with a rain of anger again. But uh, I might when I. Oh, wow. Fo focus fire. Okay, so now we know how to take these guys out. <laughs> it's called Smack Them with Cataclysm. Get some robot bolts. Get a level for Lamar. But, yeah. I'm, I'm rambling. <laughs> because I really didn't plan anything beyond the things I noticed from in that, like, final splash image. Part of me thinks that I should really sit down, like, maybe have a script? A script might be plausible? Let's Reign of Anger see what everything's weak to. Okay, so you on the right are weak to that. Oh, wow, you two are weak to... Sorry, resistant to stuff. Oh, and I probably should... 
batting stance. Let's cataclysm. You know, let's cataclysm twice. <laughs> oh no, I'm falling to the the uh <sighs> the problem of just saying what I see on the screen and what I'm doing. Maybe I should heal Miriam, but yeah, I'll probably put a list of games I'm thinking of on in the description for this one. And, you know, maybe, maybe people can, I'm not even going to say vote, maybe people can comment about like, hey, that one looks interesting or not. I don't know. Bat Barrage. Wait. Yeah, you know what? We're just gonna do that. <laughs> Use the magical power of gun. I'm a little- I'm being a little quiet here because this is good fight music. I like this fight music. <laughs> And Desolation is pretty strong, I should remember that. And, ooh, it's these guys again! I've missed you, little tile guys. You've always been a fun time. Infernal Icon, which we need to get past the door. Sorry, the jar blocking our path. I do not like that that is just question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. But I'll live with it. So yes, there is like a short goofy JRPG I've been thinking of. Um... And, like, by short, that, that one's, like, three or four, no. no. Banned, illegal, no. Cataclysm, Cataclysm, all of you, you are going to Moon's Gift everyone, and you are going to Star Drain all, because, no, we are not Death Storing anyone. Death Store is a banned maneuver. Yeah, I was thinking, like, there's a goofy little JRPG. Um, I've been thinking of maybe doing Ickenfell, which is slightly longer and would require some crap. Uh, it's fine. Lamar can, Lamar can do do his business. Um, where was it? It was Life Force. And you are just gonna reign of anger, everyone. But, uh, yeah, it can fell, which I would describe as Harry Potter meets, like, Paper Mario, but it's very gay. It is a very gay combination of these things. And part of me wants to do it because I really enjoyed playing through it with a friend like a year plus ago. It was it was a really it was a really good time. Um and the other part of me wants to play it because, you know, Harry Potter came came out recently and Screw, screw that lady. Like, I was actually thinking of doing the sequel to uh, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone for the Game Boy Color. 
so, which would be the second JRPG that exists for reasons. But like right now, I just I just don't want to do Harry Potter things because because reminding that la that people that that lady's stuff is was fun just makes me sad. I don't know. I might just be weird about that. Um, I was also thinking on the topic of some games that I'm not good at, <laughs> and it would be a lot of fumbling, and maybe I would even, like, stream parts of them? I know. Shocking, shocking concept. Uh, where was I planning on going? Oh, I wanted to go back, back here to get that. Wait, I can keep going down? Why would I want to keep going down? Can any of you... A Nashergeist sounds like you're going to do the thing, but you know I'm going to start with mine better anyway. Actually, what am I doing? I should be starting with Lumen Flash. As we all know, that is the correct way of starting fights. And also, I need to do something about Miriam's sigh. But, uh... Two games that I'm not terribly good at that we would could potentially do. I could I could do some Spyro. Because I like Spyro. And you know, it would be a good time doing a game I like that has voice acting. So I won't feel the need to give everyone goofy voices. I don't know why I feel the need to give everyone goofy voices. Like... I, I, I legitimately have no idea why I, why I enjoy it so much. Um, we're just gonna... Shoot this toaster a bunch. And you are going to crawl in chaos this... This guy, because he seems scary. But, yeah, and then the other thing, which would which is actually similarly voice acted, though not in English, is, uh, part of me kind of wants to go back to Hollow Knight, and, and you might be going like, what do you mean, go back to Hollow Knight? So, I, <laughs> when I was playing Hollow Knight with a friend, I was like 60 hours in, which is, for anyone who's familiar with the game, that's like a, that's like multiple runs, but we were, I actually didn't, I reached the final boss in around 60 hours mostly because I took my sweet time and I am bad, bad at platforming action bosses. Anyone who watches videos on my channel will see, I'm not terribly good at them. But, you know, I had a good time, and then, and I don't know if it was a combination of my computer, or, like, I, I have legitimately no idea how it did this, but after a while, it just kept on making my computer shut itself off, like, I would start it up, my computer's fan would go crazy, and my computer would just turn off. Which, uh... <laughs> which was like one of those things where it's like, okay, as long as I keep my computer cold, it should be fine. Right before I went in to go do the... the Hollow Knight fight that would let me face the Radiance, which, for anyone who's not familiar with the game, don't worry about it. Um, the com it cra Not only did it crash, but it corrupted my save, erasing like sixty hours of any progress, which was utterly disheartening. I have gone back to the game since, um, mostly dabbling. I've like not really had the heart to press through it. But you know, maybe, maybe, uh, backed up by, huh, 
That's interesting. Eat the chips. Okay, we're going to slap that in Miriam because she actually needs them. Um, we're going to, as if you had any doubt. Um, and we're actually going to Miriam this just because she's our able to hit. She's the person who's able to hit everything. Also, Miriam, take one of our twelve death filters and chase it down with an Esperade. Because you're the only one who really, who really doesn't end up... Actually, wait, no. Um, Alicia can also have a death filter as a treat. So, what's down here? Oh, it's just an item. Oh, it's another red heart. Huh, do I actually have someone who's not using something like that? But yeah, no. The, so, so those are the games I'm thinking of. But I'm, but at the same time, um, no, no. For anyone who's who can't remember, the red heart is tons of max HP plus five defense plus five resistance. But I would honestly prefer like, hey. Get a blessing, double all obels, whatever. And, uh. Yeah, I know, I think I prefer all stats plus three and preventing four status ailments <laughs> and raises evasion by 10%. Because radical. Um. It's always a shame when you pick up things that you can't really use because you have an equipment load that you prefer. Yeah, no, as you can see, most of the games that I just listed, well, other than, like, the short JRPG, would kind of take some, some doing. So, what I'm thinking right now is I'll probably go back and do some, but here's the question, do I want to do RPG Maker Quickies? Like... Because at, on the one hand, those are, well, quick. Like, like, hey, it's like I do one or two videos, one and done, we're all happy. Everyone loves it. Hurrah. You nerd. You, you massive nerd. Um... Batting stands. And that. Why not? But uh at the same time, we are getting through our twenty one and a half of this. <laughs> so Mayhaps. Mayhaps I want to try something that's not RPG Maker. Though, I do still have a game in a quote-unquote trilogy. I'm doing air quotes right now that I could do. Um, which would be... Great, now that I have to say it on camera, I legitimately, my brain just blanked. Um, walking on a faraway star, I will pop up a message on the screen with the actual correct name. Um, but it's another game by Sagawa, who is the person who did End Roll and Fair There City. Sorry, my, my brain is just not, not places. This is not places today. So, actually, what am I doing? I'll just die at Killer Console. But... Yeah, so, that, so there's that one. And that's like a cooking adventure game. For, for those of you who, see, who have seen the end roll Let's Play, it's basically what Endroll was supposed to be before he before they decided that uh 
the game was not going to focus on... <laughs> on Gardenia. As... As they apparently were originally planning. Which... I do want to do that one. But I feel like if I do that one, I feel like I have to have the... Um... The RPG indie horror... RPG maker indie horror slash whatever... I have to have the, I have to have a talk about some things that apparently come up in that game. Now I don't know much about them like myself because I'm basically just going off of no I, I went down that already. I am a silly sausage and I do, should not go do that again. Getting lost in this minimal maze, honestly. So you have an infernal icon? I want it. I demand you give it to me. Give it here now. Yes! Yes! This is the genuine article. Ha 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 ha! With this, the seal will weaken. You may pass. Okay, thank you. But, um... Yeah, no. According to the... <laughs> according to the... Translator's notes for that game, there is... A bit of content warning that I'm not really... I don't like. I don't, I don't like that it's in there. Um... You might, you might even be able to guess what it might be, just from how I'm, like, wandering around the issue. And also, if any of you watched the end of the end roll playthrough and remembered... One of the areas I mentioned was in the game, but didn't show off. Um, yeah. It's... I don't want to have that conversation. But at the same time... I, I, like, I like his games enough that I feel like I can give him the them the benefit of the doubt question mark it's it's definitely not like um oh i'm trying to think there's there's one there's okay so <laughs> no no i'm not getting to this conversation now i'm going to save it for if we ever do one of those RPG Maker games. And if you might be going like, what? What do you mean by those RPG Maker games? Well, there are recurring elements in a lot of usually RPG Maker horror games um, that are just really not treated very well. And I, I kind of blame... Silent Hill 2. Uh, but, like, maybe... Yeah, maybe if I do... So, if I end up playing something like... I don't know. If I ever decide... If I ever decide to pick up, like... Aoni or... Like... What? what are, no, I'm not picking up your star, because your star is... It's actually terrible. Um, like, we're like Dreaming Mary or something like that. We will have the talk, but not while we're not while we're here. Not while we're having. Not while we're not while we're fighting a book of matches. Um, I really should plan ahead. I think. I think part of it is also that I'm I'm also currently playing through or well spectating no, I'm not going upstairs. I'm like co-commenting a let's play of Final Fantasy 13 with my friend Kobok, who I did the Halo playthrough with. And 
I cannot talk to that. That is horrendous. But uh, yeah, she she has a a bit of a crass sense of humor. Let's just put it that way. And I feel like I played along. I played along with it and ended up saying some things I don't really like that I said. Like I like I don't like I'm not like ooh I I should. I want it deleted from the internet or whatever. I'm just like, <sighs> maybe there are some things I just shouldn't talk about on camera. I'm not the right person to talk about on camera. <sighs> or maybe I'm just like down on myself in general because I've been reminded of, oh right, I've been blocked from doing physical things, which sure but yeah no it's it's been a little whatever here recently um actually you know i might as well mention so i don't know if i've mentioned this on video i think i mentioned i was i got a new job but i got a i got a job as a li as a library clerk um and like Earlier on the week that I'm recording this, which is going to be actually, you know, it, it will be like a week to the day when this goes live. But um, so we've we've been having a we've been having a problem patron who's been coming in. Um, and by problem patron, I mean that she's like she's unmedicated paranoid, like. I know I, I'm knowing not like a professional psychiatrist or anything, so I can't know for sure. But considering why she was banned from the library, uh, yeah, no, um, I definitely, I definitely feel comfortable in saying that she should probably have been getting some, some mental help. Um, but it's just like it's really an unfortunate thing like because now if she shows up in the library again we we have to call the cops because she's trespassing and well she's like like okay she got banned because she threatened to kill my manager um but like again it's not entire like it's not exactly like how much she was aware of what she was saying but still, like, <sighs> the library's for everyone, <laughs> but sometimes you have to say no to people because they're not, they're not, like, they, they aren't safe being with themselves, and as a result, they're not really, they're not really good to be around other people, which is a massive shame. I wish it could go differently, and I've just been thinking about it. It's not made me happy, honestly. What am I talking about? I was, you know, I, I decided I was going to record this because, like, I haven't recorded in a little while, and. What, what the heck are all of you? Um, I should probably, I should probably do that because otherwise people are going to be like, what happened? Why, why did you suddenly vanish again? After being so good at telling us that you were vanishing beforehand. And the answer to that is, mm -hmm. Yeah, I was hoping this would cheer me up a little bit, and I'm not entirely sure it is. But, you know what? Talking helps. Granted, no one... <laughs> no one responds to... Like, no one comments on my videos, so for all I know, everyone who's watching this is a bot and I'm just talking to the empty air. In which case, 
Hello, bots. I hope you are having a happy time. I mean, I presume that bots can have a happy time. Like, I, I, I don't think I've ever seen someone program a bot to be on be unhappy. Mostly because that would be really depressing. Like, why would you do that? <laughs> Honestly. All right, that's... Maybe I should use those. Maybe I should use those. Maybe the bots in the audience can, uh... Can tell me I, I should use those. And maybe I should heal up Alicia after the fight. Because she's looking a little injured. Even with her regeneration. Though, hey, the constant battles are, in fact, good for leveling. No, no, I wanted skills. L Lamar, please. Use, uh, full vigor on the lady. Tyvum! Okay. Have I... Okay, there's a down... I think? Yes, I haven't been here yet. Cool. I do wish... I will say... That having it be constantly red... Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna run. <laughs> I would like to explore this area slightly more without before I have to fight something. But... Yeah, having this area be always red on the encounter bar... Okay, so you're gonna want an infernal idol and... Excuse me. Now I'm gonna have to get beaten on for a little bit. Do not do that. That is banned. Unhelpful violence against Lamar. <laughs> but we leave and Lamar full vigors himself. And we are none the worse for wear because this game has ridiculous healing in it. I love it. <laughs> Oh, hey, it's, we're back down to this. This video might also end up going long, because I'm probably going to end when I speak to that dude. So, okay, let's, let's go this side. I wonder if one of the rooms we're going to end up in is just going to be absurdly loud anyway. Okay, so we have a, one of these one-use things. Oh, we have so much. Um... Do I have any... Okay. No. Okay, not yet. Okay, so everyone has, like, Psionic Master hidden places. Let's buy her whatever. Her max HP up. Because we are going to... Yeah, like, I think we're just... We are just finishing out everyone's stat boost at this point. So yeah, probably we're probably going to do Dottie's next just to see what all of her final abilities are. But yeah, no. Having having the encounter rate be so high And apparently it never downgrades. Is a little... Excuse me. Profoundly rude. Profoundly rude. Honestly, some monsters attacking small children. Even though that small child supposedly has an ability that's like, 
Hey, attack me less if I'm in a party with someone else. Thanks, bye. And this can go to Miriam. But, yeah. Okay, so we went down the right one. Let's go down the left one. Wait, okay, so... We need to kill these oval baggies, like, toot sweet. So, Mindbender, Cataclysm, Stygian Pact, and Manmaker. Because those guys are going to give me a bunch of ovals if I kill them in time. Please don't do that. Yikes, people have been hitting people hard. Okay. Um, and we are going to Cataclysm again. We are going to Health Surge Miriam. And we're going to go back to Reign of Anger. Yeah, because you're, you're both going like, oh, we only have one turn. No, you die. Thank you for having three more health than you needed. <laughs> oh, that was kind of kind of terrifying, honestly. Oh, we have enough for more upgrades now. Thank you, Obel dude. Hollow point ammo. Let's continue to explore in here. It's down here. Besides smiling guys. And a rather, this is honestly a rather large area. Oh, this is a nice. You. I have water, though. I was prepared just in case. The humans in the evocations, not a word now, not a sigh. Oh, you thought I was going to do the voice? No. Why would I? Noble words and thoughts within them. Now it's only you and I left to operate and witness what le what fell Machio holds inside. Who was it who opened Daybreak's door and caused to step inside that champion, Alicia Copeland? You may know now. It was I. Who was it who, when the monsters slayed both Eric Vaughn and V, knit their flesh parts back together, gave them back a kind of life? Once again, you may have gathered. The Observer, it is was I. All for your sake did I do these things. Perhaps you wonder why. Without them, the evocations from Great Durless Inner Side would succeed in all their projects, something I could not abide. Still, with all your boundless power, challenging Felmachio, I could simply never have imagined such a thing you could decide, nor would I have thought to meet you in this no man's land. Now I shall take my leave, for this observer feels this place's rising tide of all-consuming mystic pressure, stealing everything that I treasure, memory and senses, voice, control. And so, goodbye. What a sinister speech. That implies something about this place, and why the evocation... Didn't didn't like it. Regen egg. What what the what the hell is a regen egg? I'm presuming it's a form of gear. Okay, all stats plus one. Fourteen percent HP regen. A servant creature's egg, warm with life, but fated never to hatch. Is that better than? No, and it's, I mean, it's, it's one of these, so 
Does anyone have an HP regen that... I mean, maybe if I want to replace the the drop rate stuff and eventually. Yeah, no, I'm I'm think I'm good on that right now. Okay, that's the way back out. We're about to get into another fight. I I leave the I leave another fight. <laughs> Oh dear. Okay, so there was a there's another entrance to that area that I need to find. Can I No, I cannot. Boo. Boo. Oh, what was that about deciding to fight everything for like the experience or whatever? Shush. Um, let's, yeah, let's head in here. No, I think that, because that return, I think that's going to return me back to the place. With the thing, you say. Okay, they're going to hit me hard. But, uh, yeah, as you can see. Fights have gotten a little tricky. Like, not to the point where we're meaningfully in danger, thanks to everyone being a tank and a half. Um, or rather, because we have so many overlapping healing things. But uh, it does make this stuff a little... It feels a little harsh. Also, if there's any, if there are any mandatory fights in here, I think I can handle them. Okay, that, that's how I got in here. That's how I would get in here. All right. Okay, and that did loot me back here. Cool. So, Dottie, we are gonna get you more hit, more hit points. Okay. Yes, we are going to grab her stat savant. Good. Good. You aren't going to die when something breathes slightly heavily on you. I mean, that is one of the few... That's one of the good things about... These... This area. I am getting obols. To the point where I, I might, um, I might just, like, put on a stream in the background and just grind ovals between now and the next episode. Excuse me. Let me run away. I do not desire to, to be in a fight right now. While well, I have to actually be presentable to other humans. But yeah, no, I, I feel like getting everyone to the point where they have, like, half, half PowerPoint costs and all that is kind of important. Anyway, let's speak to this guy, get past him. So, you have an infernal icon. I want it. I demand you give it to me. Give it here now. Excellent. You found a pristine one. All right. Ha ha ha. Let's see what we can further. You may pass. All right, let's get down to these stairs and... Oh, that's a pretty straightforward one. You know, let's do one last actual fight where I'm paying attention and we're all here. And then I will probably do a little bit of grinding in between sessions because you know right yes I want you to use your stygian pact we've kind of gotten to the point where fights take long enough that I uh I kind of want to be watching like 
a stream or something in the background while I do this. Like, I don't even like grinding, but I kind of want... I kind of feel committed to getting everything. And I kind of don't want to make you guys, like, watch me go every so often back to a place. Um, no, none of you do a thing. Bat barrage. Am I spamming? Am I, am I spamming? Yes! Um... But I mean, part of that is just because I have... Okay! Yeah, some abilities are just stronger than others, and... <laughs> Please do not kill the lady. <laughs> Miriam Mir Mir is a good lass. But hey, we got a we got one person to level 30. Wait, is that a way up? Huh. Wow, I just run in a circle. Cool. You silly sausage, I haven't even hurt you yet. Anyway. I'm Mappy. This has been more weird and unfortunate things are happening. And I hope you've enjoyed. Next time, I will have done a little bit of grinding off screen. So remember that we have three characters at level 30 and one at level 28. And that we currently have 619 ovals because those numbers are going to change. Anyway, take care and I will see you next time. Later.